Here on WSKG TV, it's time for another episode of Southern Tier Treasures. Good evening. We're at the Phelps Mansion Museum in downtown Binghamton. I'm Gregory Keeler, joined here by Sandy Kelly. Hi, Sandy. Hi, how are you? Good. And, and this is just beautiful. What is it? Well, it's a sink that was rejected by the Kilmer family. They were uh, very famous people. Yeah, the, uh, the people from Riverside who Drive. built the big Kilmer mansion Kilmer that's now mansion, part of Temple Concord. Which is still there. And they um, ordered this sink probably around 1900, and uh, they rejected it because it did not have an overflow. It didn't have a little, a little place the for drain. the water to get uh -huh. out. And so, it, but how did it come to be in your family? Well, actually, my husband is a plumber. His dad was a plumber and his grandfather. So back in 1896, when this took place, uh, my uh, gr his husband's grandfather had it, and then when he passed on, it went to my father's attic, and then it came to our attic. So it's been from attic to attic. So the Kilmers rejected it right. and said, yep. you know, Mr. Plumber, you can take this. <laughs> yeah, they just didn't want and it. And it's just sort of been floating through right. attics uh -huh. ever since. And it's been in storage. It's never been used. Well, let's take a look at the crest. This came from England, is right. that right? It was made in England. And so uh -huh. there's this lovely royal crest that when it was installed, you wouldn't have seen. It would have been right. below, <laughs> exactly. below the yeah. marble. Mm -hmm. Well, isn't that fascinating? And of course, the Kilmers, who made their fortune, among other things, Right. from mm -hmm. swamp roots. Right, exactly. <laughs> And well, from the pictures I've seen, um, it had a very ornate, you know, a lot of ornate decorations yeah. in their home. So this was so Kilmer taste. I can see taste. why it would be, the, and you know, why they would like this. So did you get a sense of what this might be worth? Well, I guess, you know, it depends on um, what you want to use it for. Someone might like the antique value of it because it certainly is old. And um, Mr. Mapes thought maybe in the neighborhood of 300. Well, isn't that lovely? So, so it's a good thing you kept a hold of it in oh, your exactly. attic. Oh, exactly. We had no idea, right? Yeah. But And Mr. Mapes was saying that besides a sink, it could be made into a table and have a glass lid made to put over it. Oh, yeah, and that'd be pretty. It'd be a good conversation piece. Well, Sandy, thanks so much for bringing it well, in Well, you're today. welcome. Thank you for having me.